Okay, so I actually tried this build out on stream and it seems to work really, really well. So I can say with some relative certainty that there is such a thing as the Looter Mag. Here we are in the simulacrum with, well, you know, Mag. So we're going to go up against some level 150 Crocodile Heavy Gunners for no particular reason being level 150. We're going to try and get as many of them into the Magnetized Bubble. Looks like we're off by one. That's okay. And now we kill them. Great, they're all dead, and we're going to kill this one now. I wonder how much damage we're going to do. Let's have a look. 507,000 damage on the fact that this particular enemy had maybe some viral procs. That's really, really good. So, what's in this build? Let's have a look. Here is the build. So it's actually a really, really straightforward build, and everything should be really self-explanatory. The big thing, of course, is that we have replaced good old-fashioned Polarize with good old-fashioned Petrify, and Petrify, of course, coming from Atlas. It's actually not a particularly expensive thing to get from the helmet, so definitely recommend that. Now, the 254% power strength is for Orgaze, so Orgaze right now is a Petrify Augment. Petrify enemies are scanned into the Codex and have a 25% chance to drop additional loot when killed. Fantastic, that's why we're bringing it up to 63% drop chance from Orgaze. Otherwise, again, because I actually replaced Polarize with Petrify, that's why I don't really care too much about the power duration on this build, bringing it to 95%, trying to keep it as close to 100% as possible, but 95% is absolutely perfectly fine. And that's pretty much it. Really, really straightforward build, like I said. The main goal really is to just collect enemies together, petrify them, and then just blow them up. Now you can blow them up with an Exergis, or a Kuva Brahma, or a Paris Prime, or a friend. That's entirely up to you. The main thing is that, so long as you can group those enemies together with your Magnetized Bubble, that's the key. Now, I have noticed that when I'm playing with allies, sometimes that causes problems. For example, if the allies are spread out too far, then the enemies are too far spread out as well, and they're not funneling in into that magnetized bubble. So, unfortunately, sometimes it doesn't work, and I feel like if you're going to use this build, you might actually have a better time by yourself. Yeah. Unfortunately. But if you have a better experience or you have a better way of dealing with this, maybe you have a much more coordinated team, let me know in the comments. But that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments below. How are you using bag outside of the old fashioned, universal, amazing, big dick friggin' perfect mag build? How are you using mag outside of the 10,000 IQ 4 augment mag build? How are you using mag outside of the looter mag build or maybe a healer mag build that I'm having a look at right now? I'm not entirely sure how that was going at the moment. Still trying to figure out some of the bits and pieces on that build. But otherwise, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you liked this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more Warframe content, and until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.